Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you my old um, two-year blocker box that I actually still use. Um, so the pads that I use for this are the Always Maxi Extra uh, Heavy Overnight Foil Pads and then the regular Always Overnight Pads. The reason why I use the Extra Heavy Pads is because um, at night my flow seems heavier. Why? Don't know. Um, I'm going to use the regular overnights if I'm like just starting my period or just getting off of my period when I'm towards the end of my period. Okay, so this is what my box looks like. Very colorful. Um, here's an overview. Camera. I mean, mirror. And yeah, so it stores 14 pads. Um, because, because I have um, mostly maxi pads in here. Um, right now I'm only storing 14, um, but if you use tampons, it's a basically a very different story. Um, so how I store this, I'm going to take all of my pads out. And just put them on the side. And this is what it looks like when it's empty. I've already seen that part. Um, but there's a false bottom that you put in to make it stand because if I take that part out it folds and, and it came with this little packet there are some coupons and um, coupons are on the back um, this is the cover um, and this is the part I found uh, really helpful um, because I got my period during the summer last year when I was starting 6th grade and going to 7th. Um, but I got this when I was in 6th grade. I um, mean it says period prep 101. Getting your period is probably the biggest change you'll experience during puberty. Be prepared be prepared with our tips below and it just lists a bunch of tips and um, questions that people have asked so I'm gonna go ahead and read them off sorry this air conditioning thing is really killing me what happens if I get my period in public ask a friend parent teacher or school nurse for help they're they're prepared for times like these um, the next question is how can I be ready for my period? Stock lots of pads or always your always locker in your always locker box. That's what this is called. And the cute thing about the box is because it says um, rewrite the rules. And it's really cute. And it I don't know why it comes with a mirror, so I guess if you if you're using tampons, um, Keep a pad in your backpack or purse. Wear a panel, panty liner daily to feel fresh and protected. Can I play sports on my period? Yes. You can wear pads or tampons for most sports. Tampons are the only form of protection for swimming and other, and great choice for athletic activities. Um, and then they just, those were just the questions for period prep 101. It's got light blue blocks, box, box right there. Um, and some of the coupons they have are actually very helpful. Um, you get $1.50 off with any purchase of all, of two always or 10 packs items. So you, so you um, the always are the always radiant or the always infinity. The Tampax Pearl or the Tampax, Tampax Radiant. Then you get a dollar off for a uh, CoverGirl cosmetic item. Um, then you. Um, five dollars off women's women's or girls uh, C9 Champion Apparel purchase of thirty dollars or more. <laughs> more um, so that's really all that's not even all the coupons you have like six coupons and yeah 
And they have a little barcode under it. I mean, not barcode, the number under it if you're shopping online, I guess. I don't know. I don't shop online. Okay, so then, how I store this, um, I actually keep the paper in the box. Um, I put it at the bottom before I put in my um, thing midget or it's gonna be called and I'm just gonna put that at the bottom and then it just looks like that and so when you're packing your um period box and I'm gonna actually show you how to make one um, for at school or at home or anywhere um, the best way to do it is like get all of if you're using different brands or different sizes um, organize them so I have four of the purples which are the extra heavy overnight pads and because when I close it you don't see the wrapper a lot and then my Got orange ones, which are the um, maxi overnight pads, go in right next to it. To me, this is the best way you can really do it. And then, if you just squish them down or move them up, or you can even, if you have bigger pads, like put one of them on its side. And then put the other one. Like that. So like, you know which pads are which. And then you could still fit tampons or wipes there. And then I have some smaller pads. Um, these are the um, Ultra Thin Always Overnight. And those are just going to go with my own. Other orange ones that don't go in. Sorry for the noise. It's I know it's making a lot of noise. And then my these are the always radiant. I think. Pretty sure these are the always radiant, and those are gonna go with my purple ones. Um, th guys, this is really good for um school if you're at a young age or um, you're just not sure if you're gonna get your period so this is actually good for this like a starter kit and um, you can actually make stuff like this I'm actually gonna show you how but you can use a pencil bag or um, a bag like this um, if you're, but if you were to use a bag like this, I have uh, my um, band-aids and stuff in here. It was my little sister's. It is my little sister's. Um, and like you can have all your band-aid stuff up there. And um, then you can have like have your pads and stuff in here. And like, yeah. Like this is just stuff you can like keep in your locker. And now I'm actually going to show you how to make your own period box. I'll be right back. Okay, one thing I forgot to mention about the box, you don't only have to put pads and tampons in here. Um, I actually have the stuff in here. So you can keep like a hand sanitizer, um, a perfume and soap. Like, if you run out of hand sanitizer and the bathroom doesn't have soap, like you have your own soap. And yeah, the scents that I have is Cherish the Moment and Truly Yours. Your smells amazing, and I'm almost out of it, but that's like my favorite perfume. Okay, now to sh uh, make your own, all you're gonna need is like a small bag with nothing in it, um, or a small box, or anything of your choice. And then you're gonna need pads for this one. I'm gonna use all of my smaller pads. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, five pads are just like 
but it's better if you use um, tampons for this one because like you'll be able to see how wide it is. Um, yeah, and you can just like hide it or put it in a purse, and it's like nobody's business if you're on if you're on your period. Like, if you want to tell people, you tell people. Don't let anybody um, make fun of you for being who you are because this is not something you can control. I mean, you're just getting older, and your body's getting ready for you to get older. So that's that. Okay, so guys, thank you for watching my video, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.